Hey guys, going to do a quick game of EDH here on MTGO. I'm playing my green red aggro deck, Rada, and I'm facing uh, Gisela deck. We're gonna, well, this is normally the strategy, but we're definitely gonna try to rush this deck down. Try to win before he can even land, the, land Gisela and go off. I'm gonna cast our commander here. And I guarantee you if he has a swords or a path or anything like that, my commander is not living to my turn. <laughs> Weathered Wayfarer is gonna be loving this deck. It's almost always gonna be able to search for a land. Yep, there it is. No third turn explosive vegetation for me. Get Scoot Mob out here. Put a land into play and pass the turn. Okay, we're going to swing before we play a land here, hoping he'll take the trade. <laughs> he doesn't take the bait, it's look, it looks like he's not going to take the bait. Nope, okay, we'll play a land and uh, cast Explosive Vegetation here. Which means he gets to search for a land as well. We'll get a forest. I think a forest and a mountain here might be good. Let's see what he gets. Okay. Yeah, forest, mountain. <coughs> On my turn, Scoot Mob gets bigger as long as it survives. It might be a vanilla creature, but left unchecked, it can cause some serious damage really quickly. O-ring. Bye-bye, Scoop Mob. Okay, let's see what we draw in our turn. Okay, we could pay, uh, play Rampage and Bailoth here, but we're just going to play a land and pass the turn here, I think. Yeah, that way, end of his turn, we can uh, Relic Crush the O-Ring and his uh, Mana Rock. Which means at the beginning of our next upkeep, Scoot Mob will get bigger. And be able to attack. Assuming he doesn't do anything on his turn. Uh, yeah, that's fine. He won't be able to get it to a level up to 6 this turn. So it seems fine. We can definitely kill that before it levels up all the way. We could have blocked with Scoot Mob here, but it's not worth the trade for one damage. It's better to have a 5-5 Scoot Mob instead of trading for the Wayfair at this point in the game. Just auto yield this. Okay, uh, we're gonna swing here. There's no way he blocks this. It'd be pointless. We'll play land here and pass the turn. It's a three level. It's 
at level 3 right now so what we'll do is we'll wait for him to tap his mana to level it up and when he's putting the 6th level counter on it we'll cast Bogard and Hellkite and kill it in response so fine that's 4 fine that's 5 not fine we'll uh... do three to him then three to the wayfarer and then one to his life sure but he searched for land in response We're going to go with, uh, I think, Bloodbraid Elf here. If we don't hit anything, we can still at least harmonize after our attack. No, not for zero. So we'll draw three cards and pass the turn here. Well, unless we get a land. Okay, looks like he has enough for Gisela here, but I don't think that'll be enough to save him. The scoot mob is gigantic at this point. A board wipe would help him though. Okay, he concedes. Thanks for all thanks for watching LIFM guys.